Welcome back, and welcome to Opportunity, where we are going to kill Jack's double. And wouldn't you know it, it's nighttime around here. Let's just try to sneak by people. Try not to make some noise. Anybody here? Oh boy. Sure, no one else heard that, right? I'm sure we're good. Fire doesn't work well on robots. <clears throat> yeah, I like this acid man. Shoot him in his robot penis. I'm sure this noise isn't causing a scene, right? I'm sure I'm still totally being a good little spy sneaking around. That's how you get around the map without making a scene. All right. Now we can start activating these. Ooh, what's that one? Your saber turret can be deployed using longbow. To oh, ooh, oh, much further away. Also increases health. Very good. What do we got with survival? Just curious. Increases your shield. Increases your maximum health. Increases your shield. Increases your gun damage. Wait. Oh, well, I'll fight you from there. Ooh. Who increases saber? Yeah, I like that. Maybe we'll do that next one. Increases reload speed. Oh, well, look at that. I definitely need that one. Feast your eyes upon the paradise that awaits you in opportunity. So yeah, I worry about my health, so I'm not going to get money yet. Because I have a feeling I might die. Oh, whoops, I just meant it. Oh, well. I wish they had uh, snipers with mufflers on it, you know. So I could shoot quietly. Oh boy. Oh, look, it took the fire. I'm surprised fire's doing so good. Ooh. I've not used this one before. Oh! Well, okay. Oh boy, here we go. Acid and fire and oh hello. Try to shoot your arms off. Shoot them. I just try to shoot the joints. Oh boy. Try to shoot the the joints between it. There you go, and I'll knock the There you go. If it had still had some health it would use its little Eye laser shooter thing. 
Let's reload. It's got a lot of guns reloaded. Oh boy, get out of my Watch out for that guy. close to me. I don't like that. Oh, somewhere right there? Alright. Oh boy. How is it not resisting this fire? I don't know. God, there's so many more. Jack's body double. One of those two right. There he is, Jack's body double. I want to use some sort of. Uh, something that will knock his shield down. So let's. Well. For the time being, do I have? Wait, am I at a level 25 now? Oh my goodness, look at that! I'm at a level 25. So I can use this gold gun. We'll go ahead and switch that for that. But I don't have... a... Uh, an electricity gun. So we're just gonna have to make do. That's one of the body doubles Jack uses to confuse assassins and impress his underlings. I have had There's a promotion in this. I like how Jack's body double talks in a monotonous voice. This is how we deal with Damn it. Oh, look at that. Oh, I really... This gun owns him. Oh, if I can get him in one try. Come on, load. Grab the pocket watch device he dropped. It echoes his biosignature to every machine in the immediate area. So that pocket watch also records audio. Jack loved to listen to the praise of his underlings. We need to create a voice modulator so you can speak in Jack's voice. Get to an info kiosk. Hell yeah! First time I played this game, I had so much trouble beating him. See what these super hard to find guns can do? Boom! Yeah! It's way different than that other gun. Of course! Bandits attack at the end of my shaft! Did you know that some people on this planet still believe in silly superstitions? Like angels, demons, and ancient alien warriors? We like to call them bandits. Now reading of this week's yes, destruction this casualty. is going to work. Hard if I get a few me. more samples of Trust Jack's voice, me. I can make a voice Bird modulator for you. You need to get Banger more voice samples from the other info kiosks. Now a moment of silence for the workers lost. Alright, that was it. Back to work. Hey, what do you know? People talking over each other. I think every single video that I've done so far with talking has had voice. People talking over each other. Yes, I do. Hey kids, did you know your chances of being disemboweled increased by 80,000% upon leaving Opportunity? 
It's a scientific fact. I almost have what I need. Just activate a few more kiosks. Ah, screw it! Did you know you were staring at the future site of the Opportunity Pleasure Palace? That's right. For a thousand bucks, you'll be able to spend an hour with a life-size likeness of me. It's either no one talking or everyone talking. Can you imagine what this, how chaotic this would sound if we had the music playing over it too? Really? I can't go through there? Alright. Turning into morning. Hey, guess what? Someone talked over it. Hey, kids. Did you know what your mommies and daddies gave up so your family could live an opportunity? Literally nothing. Your family is paid to be here. I'm the one who feeds and protects everyone. Remember, we should all love our parents. But love me more. When you hit that shield, they bounce off and... That's right! Let her mow you down! Look how easy that was. Can I go in the water? Very good. Can I get out of the water? Ooh, that's good. Supposed to be able to work in the water. All right, so we got to upload the samples. I got distracted with my new gun. Attach the pocket watch quickly. Now my grenade's pretty good. Or, you know, slowly. Aha, uh -huh, she made fun of my pacing. Be glad I even heard you. I see the files. All done. Now grab the voice modulator. Great. Now, unfortunately, you will speak in Jack's voice until you reach the security door. I will tell you the password to open it at the appropriate time. Testing. Testing. One, two. One, two. Now I have the voice of a douchebag. Great. <laughs> You seriously thought you could hide from me, Angel? Is that what you thought? 
Say goodbye to your friend, Angel. Say it. <sighs> See you soon. Hmm, what could that? Found a way past the final door to Angel's control core, huh? Well, she's kept her part of the bargain, surprisingly. Time to return the favor. Come on back and we'll steal ourselves a vault key. We still have some other missions here, but we're going to turn in first. Because I'm trying to keep to my word on that. Also, my gun is doing pretty well, so I'm not really worried about moving ahead. Oh, listen to my jump voice. That's what Jack sounds like when he jumps. This isn't a discussion. You're not going without me. Period. Look, I need you here protecting Sanctuary. If this turns out to be a trap, I need you to keep these people safe. Is this because Angel told me not to come? It is, isn't it? Lilith. Damn it, would you just trust me, okay? If you get killed, I'm gonna be really pissed. Noted. If you live, I'm tearing those clothes right off your body. Yeah, Lil, also, you stand right here. Also noted. Nobody wants to hear that. Go on. <laughs> Brick wants to hear about it. Oh. Time to think up some memorable last words. This is it, everybody. Lilith, Mordecai, you're protecting the city. Brick will provide air support from Thousand Cuts, and I'll climb up to Control Core Angel from the cliff face. Any questions? Yeah, why ain't I going? I gotta pay Hyperion back for Bloodwing. And you will, but for now, I need you protecting Sanctuary in case this is just another trap. You'll get your payback, Mordecai. I promise. Long as you say so, Roland. Vault Hunter. We have a shot at stealing the vault key and stopping Jack from waking the warrior. All you have to do is get past a force field that'll atomize you, destroy a bunker carrying enough firepower to level a continent, and get through a door you can't possibly open. That's his way of saying we're probably gonna die. It's time to get Claptrap to Thousand Cuts. We need him to shut down the force field. Make it painful, guys. This is gonna be fun! <laughs> Oh yeah. We're gonna tackle that later. Story mission. Um Yeah. Hey, Slab. Let's go back to Opportunity and grab those two other exclamation point jobs that I saw. I think one of them is going to be at a board, at the jobs board, so there might be more than one. waiting for that to finish. Every good war is one in the mind. So long as Jack's got those propagandastic statues of himself around opportunity, we can't truly win this war. Go, Minion! Blast those statues to bits! The statues are bulletproof! You win this round, inanimate object! Minion, I need you to search the opportunity drop zone for a deactivated constructor. Then, you can use it to cut through the statues for you! Would have been too easy to shoot. Mm 
I'll tell you. Come on back, turret. Let's go ahead and power this guy up. He's waking up. Great. Trust the Vault Hunter robot. All right. The constructor's working again. Make sure to protect it while it's wrecking the statues. This reminds me of the robots in Oblivion, just not as circular. I somehow always assign like a real life and emotion to things, even to inanimate objects, even video game ones. Now I really don't want it to get hurt. I'll feel bad. So I've got to protect it. Come on, little one. Eyes open, boys. We're hearing reports of vault hunters infiltrating the city. Don't be afraid to run. We're not getting paid enough. Oh, Exclamation point here somewhere. Well, we'll do that in a second. Your vision before you. Uh, nope. I can actually see why you want to turn that particular statue down. Clearly illiterate, and the image of me enjoying a good book just makes you so awesome. Loaders, let the engineers take bandit fire. This is called teamwork. Shoot. Nice. In the top right corner. Progress bar. It looks like he's a little more than halfway hurt. But on the one on the center of the screen, it looks like he's a little less than halfway hurt. Hurt on the field! The has been damaged! Oh, 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 oh,
Definitely do this. I think we took care of everyone we needed to take care of. Now it's just sitting and watching this thing cut. Or watching me get things. Almost there. I do all this work to keep him alive. We became buddies, teammates, and then he... It. Dies. It's sad. Huh. Yeah, I run in the glass walls if I want to. Oh, 
Oh, look at that. It's Bloodwing. This is Handsome Jack welcoming you to Opportunity. If you want to learn more about Opportunity and the things I'll do to you for breaking the rules, just activate one of the many info kiosks around the city. This is exactly what I'm about to do. Welcome to the Hyperion Hall of History. All citizens who reach the end of our historical tour will receive a sizable tax refund. In the beginning, Pandora was chaos. And then there was Jack. When Jack came to Pandora, he found a world of danger and hardship. Jack armed himself to the teeth using the quality armaments of Hyperion, the company he called home. Jack learned of a legendary vault that housed a terrible evil. He defeated many horrors to reach the vault. Hideous monsters and vicious bandits. This area right here was uh, the final battle, and those are the tentacles from the final monster that the Vault Hunters killed in the last one. Um, no, don't sh shoot me right now, don't bring me things. So those are, so this is misinformation because it was one of the characters, one of the Vault Hunters from the previous game that defeated it, not Jack. So, propaganda, misinformation. And five years ago, Jack defeated the monster inside the vault, triumphed over the evil treasure seekers, and brought peace to Pandora. With that done, the handsome one staked a claim on the very planet he had saved. For the opening of the vault bore a wonderful secret only he could have predicted. Oh, way better. Iridium. This mysterious alien element flourished across Pandora, and Jack became an overnight trillionaire. Today, Jack now the owner of the Hyperion Corporation, has dedicated his life to bringing bandit scum to justice. There is only one word to describe what Jack has become to Pandora. And now a reading of this week's construction casualties. Hardnell, W. Trout, P. Pertwee, J. Baker, T. Now a moment of silence for the workers lost. All right, that was it. Back to work. Well, we almost had silence over that. Uh, the uh, word was hero, but maybe you could see that in the subtitles. Thank you for visiting the Hall of History. Take this tax refund as a reward for your continued loyalty. We did it. So, guess what, kids? We're doing our story mission next. Where angels fear to tread. We're doing that next. Let's go ahead and travel, make our way there.